Hello guys, in this video, I will show you 5 useful free softwares for indie game developer. I am not going to cover the extremely popular softwares like Blender, Gimp, Krita, etc. And I am not going to cover any game engine. These are few lesser known softwares that I found which might be useful for you guys. So the first one is called Treat. So this software allows you to create tree meshes for your game. Now this comes with a lot of pre-made trees so you can easily open one up and customize it to your liking. You can increase the length, the radius. You can add roots, you can increase the number of trees, etc. You can also easily create LODs with this. So, here you can see tree poly reduction. You can reduce the polygons of the tree and the leaves, etc. So, you can easily create different LODs for your tree. Also, you can create billboards for your tree. So for that, click on tools, then orthographic, then click render to texture. So we get this texture. You can use this for creating billboards. So this is a great software. I will put a link to it below in the description. All the software I mentioned in this video, I will put a link in the description so you can download it from there now the second software is called awesome bomb so with this you can create pbr maps for your texture so open up a texture um let me find a texture uh, you need to go to diffuse then click this then open a texture up then click enable preview show height we can uh, view the normal like this now we can increase the smoothness uh, the detail etc of your normal map Then after you finish, click this convert to NH. Then uncheck this enable preview. So we get this texture. Now I think I have disordered it a bit. I will open it again. Um, uh, some error with tiling I think yeah this is the problem okay so we need to create it again so then uncheck this enable preview so as you can see we have created the PBR maps for our texture like the diffuse map normal map, specular map, the height map, occlusion map, roughness map and the metallic map. You can also create tiling textures with this software. This is a great software. This is a bit older version. I will uh, link, it, link the newer version in the descriptions below. So you can also play around with the settings here. You can change the environment. change the mesh you can also import your own mesh I think yeah you can now the third software is called Sculptris so this is a bit like ZBrush you can sculpt anything here so it got lot of brushes like crease draw flatten a smooth 
in flight etc you can also reduce all the polygons by clicking this or you can use the reduce brush to reduce it uh, you can uh, apply different materials to it so this looks cool after you finish you can uh, paint it by clicking paint it automatically automatically unwrap the uv so you can paint this color or any texture into this so this is a great tool if you like sculpting meshes for your game now the third tool i want to show you is called Uh, no, the fourth tool I want to show you is called Instant Remesh. So with this, you can retopologize your mesh. So I'm going to show you how to do this. Now click Open Mesh. Then you need to open up a mesh. And we can preview this. Then we need to uh, set the vertex count. I'm going to leave it at default then click solve so we get this lines this can be adjusted for your liking these are the edge lines then click this solve so we get this you can adjust the singularities and uh, all other settings from here then after that click export mesh then extract mesh so we get this low poly version of our mesh so this is great for retopologizing your mesh you can uh, retopologize it here and fix it in blender or something like that if you make a high poly mesh or something you can easily reduce the polygons using this software now the fifth and final software i want to show you is called terrain sculpture now the standard edition for this software is free. This software is this software is used for creating height maps for your game terrain. So click file then click new project and select a size you want and we are going to generate a Perlin noise map. So adjust the settings as you like. and click ok so we get this nice looking terrain we can also modify it we can modify the altitude altitude center we can normalize it invert this resemble this smooth this etc so this is going to take a lot of time if i click ok i'm not going to do that and we can extract uh, the altitude map, direction map, flow, line mask, slope mask, etc. You can add erosion to this also after you finish uh, creating your terrain. Just export this. And if you are uh, going to use the terrain height map in Unreal Engine, you have to export it in this format raw 16 bit binary and give it a name and export it then uh, from in conversion change this to scale for unreal engine i don't know what it is for other engines then click ok so thanks for watching guys these are the five useful softwares that i found for you thanks for watching Subscribe for more videos like this. Thanks.